Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm just gonna hike these. I'm wearing cycling shorts and a fancy top, but I don't want my stomach out, so we're just gonna sit like this. I feel like I haven't done a sit down video in literally so long. I guess I've just, I've just had so much to vlog, because I've had my birthday and then I went to MAGA, so... I'm back. I'm sitting down and basically I went shopping with my mum for like a really late birthday present. We went um, at the weekend and she's been so lucky. She spoiled me. Got so many nice new things and I also bought myself a couple new things like before I went to my and stuff so I thought I'd show them as well. Some of the stuff I got on my birthday from other people as well. So yeah. If you do enjoy the video, please don't forget to give it a like and also subscribe if you're, subscribe if you're new and we'll get into the video. Okay, so the first thing that I got was actually from Harry's family. It's my new night air force. I literally love them so much. Thank you so much for them. I wear them pretty much every day that I can, even to work. They're just like so perfect and they're so white at the moment still as well obviously they're probably not completely as white as they used to be but i just love them so much they literally go with every outfit so yeah i got these in a size five but you can get them whatever size fits you <laughs> so we're gonna go on to top shop it wasn't there wasn't that much good stuff you know how it's the sales i always feel like when top shop has a sale on i can't find any good stuff not in the sale i was looking for a cropped denim jacket and i found the perfect color but they only had like size 12 and up and it was just way too like baggy and oversized so the first thing i actually got was a pair of straight leg jeans which i've been wanting for ages they've been in like fashion for so long so i got kind of like these washed black denim ones. They're really, really nice. They've got these little sort of rips at the bottom. They are a lot tighter on the thighs than I thought they would be, but I don't know if that's just me. I got them in a waist 26, length 32, and these were 42 pounds, which is very expensive for jeans, I think. But I remember when Topshop jeans used to be like 30 pounds, and now they're 42 pounds. So, yeah, but with student discount, they're like £37, pounds something, so still not the best, but we'll see these on. Yeah, I don't know if you can see the bottom, but this is the bottom. Please ignore my feet. Yeah, we're just going to get as far back as possible on the tip toes. Kind of looks a bit far more like a bit scarecrowy. Just ragged at the bottom. I think they're really, really nice, really comfy, a lot comfier than skinny jeans. So I'll definitely be wearing these out. Just kept the plain top on so that you can see the fit of them. They're a vibe for me. Okay, so the next thing I got actually like really surprised me. You know when you just try something on just because it's interesting? Basically, it's this like, oh, let me zip it up. Ooh. This like boiler suit, but in a play suit version. Khaki denim. It kind of reminds me of like being in like Top Gun in the army and stuff. It's just so nice and I think it's really versatile. It's got loads of pockets. One's at the front, one's down here at the front, any at the back? No, not at the back. But you could have it like completely undone with like a bralette underneath or a black bodysuit or something underneath or you could literally not wear anything underneath and just have it like zipped up there. Yeah, I just thought this was so cute. I got it in a size 6 and apparently it's priceless this is a very cute like khaki denim boiler suit i li i literally love it so much it's quite a flatter on the back this is petite i think i definitely need a petite because there's lit they're not like there's no bum coming out and when i walk if it was any longer i think it would gather loads here so i'm really glad that i have got it in the petite so you could do it all the way up you can have it a little bit undone i've got a black thingy on underneath to show you like what it could look like like that proper like off the shoulder i don't know if that's really out there because the outfit's already quite out there but i think it's just so cool like it would look cool for a festival it's obviously gonna look cool for like day-to-day -day summer wear i just think it's really really cool and i've got a black buckle belt that i could wear with it so yeah i do really really like this one and it's something i would never obviously i was trying it on because i thought it looked cool it's something i'd never really pick up myself and be like, oh yeah, let's get that. So I'm really, really grateful that my mum liked this one as well. It's also got little pockets here with like little black 
same kind of material as the buckle belt which I think is really nice to put it all together this was a size 6 and also so basically in, it was in the Topshop sale it was £13.50 and I got 10% off so it was it was £11 so for a denim skirt from Topshop I think that's a very very good price okay so we now have the Topshop skirt on this would look so cool for a festival I really really like it so yeah you can see like it fits so nice I think probably the buckle belt helps but it fits so nicely like on the bottom area. I just really really think it's so cool. I don't even care that it's gone a bit pink. Like it's actually quite cool. The colour. I really really like it. This belt actually is not the belt that comes with it. The belt that comes with it is better because it's adjustable but I've given that to my friend for a festival so this is actually just a belt from a pair of trousers that I have but I thought I'd show you with the buckle because that's what it comes with. The pockets are really good. Let me just show you. So basically the pockets, my phone has quite a big like industrial case on it it fits in like so so easily and i put my keys in the other one because i wore this to a festival the other day so it's actually really really handy okay next one is this zara zara really surprised me like usually i don't find a lot of stuff in zara but you know it was it was good they have a really good sale on at the moment so the first thing i got is actually from the sale it's really cool it's kind of like a denim shirt like you could either wear it as a shirt or wear it as a jacket so that'll be really good in winter when like i just want to wear it as a shirt and be warm it's like a normal normal denim shirt it's kind of a bit oversized just the zebra print but it's kind of like a maroon and brownie kind of colors it's a size medium so that's probably why it's a bit oversized it was like the only one that i could find so if it's not on the website if it's sold out then try and find something similar it was originally 30 pounds and it was down to well 29.99 and it looks like it got bumped down once and then it got bumped down again to 15.99 so that was a really good deal i just really like it something different okay so this is the denim zebra shirt I can't find my normal cycling shorts, this is really annoying because I feel like this is what I'd wear it with with like plain black cycling shorts, I think it would look really really cool. It's not actually that long, it's quite cropped, um, so this is what it looks like undone, which I actually think I prefer it undone. I think it's just so cool, like I'd wear it as a jacket rather than a shirt probably, I'm just covering the logo because I think that puts it off a bit, but yeah I, lit I love it so much, it's not too hot. But like I feel like it would keep me warm. The sleeves are kind of oversized but I actually quite like it. Goes with like the kind of, I don't know, would you call this edgy? It's kind of edgy isn't it? Goes with kind of like the edgy vibe. Um, I just really really like it I think. Something different like I've never really seen anyone wearing it before. So yeah I'm quite glad this is in a medium because I like how it's like oversized because it's quite cropped. I think it'd be weird if it was a small. And the next thing is literally maybe my favourite purchase of the weekend like Oh, it's so so nice. So basically, it's this kind of like I don't even know how to explain the color. Color? Color. It's like corally orange pinky. It's just oh, I'm so happy. I nearly didn't find it, and we were going to the changing rooms, and as I was walking past like a rail, I saw it, and I was like. I need to have that. So I got it in a size extra small, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, and this was £15.99, so the same as the shirt. That's actually quite a good price for this. The material's lovely. Like, it's kind of... I don't really know what you'd call it, but it's kind of, like, silky. It's a bit, like, rough, if you get what I mean. Rough silky? I don't know if that makes sense. It's be really cool for festivals, like, going out for dinner. And it's all elasticated, so at the back... <laughs> why the extra sort of fit me <laughs> so i've just put this top on with the jeans oh i just love it it is so cute i just there's literally nothing to thought about it i had the little like you know the things <clears throat> you know the things that like help it stay on the hanger i had them so i had to cut them out because they were really obvious because it's stretchy it's not digging into me it's not making me feel uncomfortable with the little thing at the back which is quite nice actually just leaving my hair up like this in each clip so you can see the clothes properly i love the material i love the color i love the fit i kind of love everything about this top okay so that was what i got from zara I went to urban outfitters urban outfitters i love but it's pricey. <laughs> Basically, this I think this is the only thing I got from the sale. This is just really basic baby pink denim skirt. Got a little label on the back there of the brand, BDG. I think that's Urban Outfitters brand. I'm not really sure. So basically, look, this was in the sale. It says what? It says £36. This was £18. So it was 50% off and it didn't even say. So like, it really put me off picking up clothes because I didn't know whether they were actually in the sale. But yeah, this is really, really basic. Got it in extra small and yeah, it was £18. This is the Urban Outfitters little skirt. I'm just tiptoeing because I don't really know if you can see everything. But I thought I'd just put on a really simple, like plain black banner top on so that you can see the fit. It's such a good fit around the waist. So this is an extra small. It's not like too tight, but it's 
digging in, do you know what I mean? It's not too loose that it's falling down. Like I wouldn't need a belt with it, but I could still put a belt on it, if you know what I mean. I really like it, it fits really well on the back as well. Pretty nice colour. I've just seen that there's a stain, but that will come out in the wash. Another good one for the summer. So the next thing I got from Urban Outfit is like, it really surprised me. I didn't think I was gonna like it as much as I did. Like when I put it on, it just, it was so figure flattering. So it's this really cute little, oh, maybe I should tie up the top. Okay, well you'll see it when I try it on. So it's really cute like little daisy dress. I just think it's adorable. It's like the kind of milkmaidy vibes. Kind of like a, it's not chiffon is it? It's kind of, sh it's got like a chiffony overskirt and then it's got black underlayer which is like thick so it's not see-through so cute and it was so figure flattering it is oh my god it was 42 pounds wow she's steep it was in an extra small with every shop we went in obviously i used the student discount so this is the cute little dress from urban outfitters with the daisies on it i just honestly it is so cute i didn't realize it's actually really short at the back if i bend over there there will be issues but oh it's just so nice i love how i didn't think i mentioned this but it's got like a frilly hem at the bottom really cute little like milkmaid puffed sleeve it doesn't really look much different tied loosely but i just think it's really really pretty really cute this is like the perfect thing to wear to a barbecue it's so comfy again as well and it's obviously not see-through because of this bad boy okay and the last thing we got from what is it? Urban Outfitters. I'm actually wearing, so it's these cycling shorts. I'll show you better in a try on clip. But they're just like the Adidas cycling shorts. You can probably get them from Adidas. Any sporty shop. They're so comfy. I've worn them every single day since we bought them. Um, got them in an eight. I'm not sure if they would have fit around my legs if I got the six, because they're like, they're not tight, but I feel like maybe they would dig in if I got six. I think they're 25 pounds. Obviously, that's a little more expensive than like the six pound ones that you get on Pretty Little Thing or whatever, but I'm gonna wear these to the gym. I could not wear those ones to the gym. These are not see-through, they're so much thicker. And I think like the three stripes and just the little logo, I know mean, you can't really see it right now. Like it just adds something a bit different. Basically, this is how I style them like really chill, probably have my hair in a ponytail or something. Got, I was talking about the black t-shirt with the white writing. I think it just works so well with the white with the white writing on the cycling shorts. They're just so easy. So wear them with a baggy top or wear them with just like a sports bra. They're just really, really nice, really comfy. I like them a lot. And they're not see-through either, which is always a bonus. Another shop, this is actually the first shop that we went to, and this is gonna be the last of the items that I bought at the weekend, was Brandy Melville. I have these two dresses that I literally wear from there all the time, like they're just the most so easy to throw on, so I was determined to find another one like that that I can just wear every summer. So it's this little cute, it's kind of like lilac -y blue, baby blue colour, with just like simple little daisy print. Um, I just thought it was so cute. It is a little bit small on the chest because everything they do is one size. If I'm honest, that's a bit stupid. Not everyone is one size. Everyone is completely different. Not everyone is one size, let alone, like, not everyone is size 8, let alone the exact same everywhere on that size 8. Do you know what I mean? But anyway, but yeah, she's comfy, she's flowy. Um, £22, and I think that's really good for Brandy Melville, considering that dress was £42 from Urban Outfitters. Okay, so we have the Brandy Melville little dress on. Just paired it with this clip that I got from Miss Guide and these earrings too, and this necklace, I think, is either from Miss Selfridge or Miss Guide. Can't remember. I just think it's really cute. You can kind of dress it up and dress it down. I am obviously quite short, so <laughs> if you pull it to like where it's meant to be, it looks really <laughs> bit stupid not gonna like lens into a midi dress i just pull it up you know i think it's just like so easy one of those little numbers just to throw on if you're maybe going out for like a quick lunch date or literally just for the day i think it's stupid that it's in one size because it's too long for me but i really like it so just one thing that i got before my holiday i haven't actually worn it yet this is gonna look so confusing this is a swimsuit from pretty little thing i've wanted this for ages like i've seen it on the website for so long bell lucia wears it on the website oh and it's inside out bell lucia wears this on the website and i've always thought it looks so nice they've got it in so many different colors now like brown snake print pink snake print multicolored stuff just plain black probably these bits here why the chest area goes in and then you tie it around the waist and i always think tie up swimsuits are so much more flattering because they can actually pull your waist in because i don't really have one i'm <laughs> very straight up and down so i need something to give me a little cinch it's just basic and i think i wear it more as a bodysuit rather than a swimsuit this is a six this is why 
I wanted to get it because she is an absolute version in it. I don't quite look like that, but you know, we can dream. Okay, so it was £22. Okay, so we have the little shopping costume slash suit number on. I've tied it at the front. The string is really, really long, so you can literally tie it around as many times as you want. I like it. It's really simple, really basic. I don't know if I'd actually pair it with this skirt, but it was just the first black bottoms that I could find. I'd probably wear it with flares. I like it. I think it's quite good because I got it in a size 6. It would fit like any size. You can have this over more if you want to be more conservative. You can have it over less. Like, it's very customizable, if you know what I mean. Enjoy this one. We've got the final item. I left this till last because if you've seen my birthday vlog, you will have seen it. But I just thought I had to put it in because I'm never going to buy anything from here myself because it's very expensive. So this item is from House of CB and Harry got it for me for my birthday. I know it's really expensive and I probably wouldn't spend my own money on it, but it's so worth it. Suck you in in all the right places. They just make you look like a million dollars. It is heavy and it, like you can tell it's worth the money. I think on the website this is £79 and it was originally like £129. It's an extra small. Let me just quickly check for you. It's in like burgundy maroon colour. It's £79. Yeah, £79. And on the website it looks brown. So don't be fooled. It's actually a lot nicer colour in real life. So I completely, completely forgot that this dress is really hard to do up by yourself. The zip is a bit sticky. I don't know whether that's why they maybe like reduce the price of it. Like the zip doesn't really go up very easily. This is just it basically half done. You can see how far it's been done up. Um, but it's so, so nice even with it half done up. Like that shows how much it's even going to suck you in even more. I'm not wearing a bra with it, but I feel like you could easily wear a bra with it because obviously there's all the way up here and there's no open back once you've done it all up. So that would be fine. Um, yeah, I just think like, it's so flattering. Like I haven't even got it done up the whole way. I'll just show you some of the videos from my birthday. Um, insert them as well. And yeah, I love it. So that was the last item. Thanks so much for watching. If you did enjoy the video, don't forget to give it a like and of course subscribe if you're new and I'll see you really soon with the next video when I'm going to be in Budapest. Bye!